Chris, what is the significance of the Community Bill of Rights to um, the Youngstown community? Our community in Youngstown is representative of everything else that's going on in the world now. Not just Ohio, not just in the United States, but the entire world. When you think of all of the conglomeration of pollutants that are accumulated by drilling, by the oil and gas industry. You look at Youngstown, who's been spotlighted for uh, being an industry target now for a couple of years. They've been saying, we're going to frack Mill Creek Park, we're going to frack the west side, we're going to frack here, we're going to frack here. We've got the oil and gas industry coming up over to Cavelli Center to um, try to influence people into their cause, trying to get people to think that, hey, fossil fuels is still the way to go, even though we know that they're limited, and even though, though that we know fossil fuels are dirty, they're harmful to our health, they harm the environment. So the Community Bill of Rights in relationship to Youngstown means that we as citizens of Youngstown, Ohio, should be making a choice. Do we want clean water? Do we want clean air? Do we want clean jobs? Or are we going to give in to the corporate idea of keeping us down, keeping us unhealthy, keeping our environment polluted? I say no. I say people of Youngstown, wake up. Vote yes for the Community Bill of Rights. Vote yes for clean water. Vote yes for clean air. And vote yes for clean jobs, all in November. Okay, thank you very much.